Is this thing on? There we go. What is up, KJ fam? Today is our very first vlog. For those of you who know, or maybe not know, uh, Jamil and myself, we have a mukbang channel. And so we decided to do this vlog channel because we want to show you our lifestyle um, outside of mukbangs. What do we do before the mukbang? What do we do with after the mukbang? For those of you who don't know, a mukbang channel is basically like an eating show. So we um, eat and we talk and we have a really good time. But in order to maintain this um, kind of eating lifestyle, you know, that we do for a living, it's really important that we do healthy things outside of our mukbangs. Basically, a goal that Jamil and I have is we want to lose 20 pounds before we head on out to our vacation to Las Vegas sometime in December. It's super important for us to be active and to exercise a lot, to eat healthy. So today, we're going to be going for a nice long hike. It's like in the 90s today. Whose idea was that? Was that your idea, Jamil? Pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. No, it was Jamil right now is making some smoothies for us. So we're gonna be showing what those look like in a second. But yeah, we just wanna show you kind of what we do, what we eat, what our lifestyle kind of looks like. So let's go ahead and see what Jamil is doing in terms of his smoothies. Hey babe, how's it coming along? It's coming along good. Just getting it all situated. <laughs> it should be good, hopefully. Have it all laid out. How does the presentation look? It looks so beautiful. Okay. It looks super healthy. Thank you. Okay, let me show you guys what we actually have on here before we get it blended. So I'll just take that over here. Sure, thanks babe. No problem. Okay you guys, so here's what we got. We got some kale right here, some fresh kale. We have some fresh, uh, fresh, fresh spinach right here. We got just one banana. I was gonna do like two or something like that, but let's just keep it with one banana. And we got some frozen blueberries that we got from Safeway, by the way, um, which hopefully are pretty good. I should've got the real thing, but I wanted them kind of cold, so I got the frozen ones. Um, and then as far as liquids go, we got some coconut water right here. We're gonna put that whole thing in and just to sweeten it up a little bit, get a little bit of honey going right here as well. So yeah, you guys, it should be really good. Um, shout out to my mom, by the way, cause she actually got us this really powerful blender. What's it called again? Oh, I think it says right here, Vitamix. She got us this Vitamix blender. So shout out to you, mom. Really appreciate that. So anyways, guys, let's get this smoothie going. Okay, I want an honest review, okay? Yep, I'm ready to give it. There it goes. Well, bottoms up at the same time. It smells like it has a lot of greens in here. <laughs> That's because it does. Too many. <laughs> Ooh. Honest? It's really good. It's okay? Mm hmm. Mm. The color is off putting, but it tastes very fruity. Nice. But you can also tell it definitely has like a lot of spinach in there. That's exactly my plan. Mm -hmm. That's good. High five? Yeah. Nice. Good job, babe. Thank you. All right, we just had our smoothie, so I think we're about to head out the door. We got our keys right here, and we are headed to the trail, so we will see you guys in just a moment. Wish us luck. Wish us luck. Peace.
Okay, you guys, we just got back from our walk. As you can see, I am beet red. I did not put on sunscreen. I know, I know, I know. I had to be the one to remind her to put the sunscreen too. <sighs> I know. <laughs> this guy. I'm like, Remind wait, where's your sunscreen? <laughs> this was the hardest walk I've done in a long time because we yeah. do this walk a lot. Yeah. But it's 96 degrees outside. I was like, not okay. <laughs> I even yacked once. I was like, meh. So you didn't yak, you hacked. Oh, what's the difference? Well, yakking is throwing up. Oh, I didn't Hacking yak. is coughing. I hacked. <laughs> is yakking throwing up? Oh, yes. Okay. I hacked. I did not throw up. It was about a mile overall, uh, you know, in a full circle. Um, the hill at the end, guys, is crazy. And once again, I mean, this is the hottest day ever to go on this walk. Ugh. There's like three people out here when normally it's like packed. There was a lot of poop on the trail. Um, there's a lot of cows and horses that yeah. are on this trail. And mm. oftentimes you have to go around the cows, which is kind of funny. Yeah. Just got to be vigilant. That's right. Avoid the poop. Yeah, you got to look down. You can't be looking straight ahead. No. <laughs> or definitely not up. You got to look down, you know, because there's a lot. There's a lot of vineyards around here, so it's yeah. really pretty scenery. Mm -hmm. It's definitely a gorgeous day, just very, very hot. We didn't even have to walk. We could have just stood in one spot and be sweating like this. Well, you guys, we're going to go uh, stop by the grocery store. And go to Starbucks. Exactly. Well, yeah, Starbucks first, grocery store, back home, and we'll see you guys in just a few. We'll see what we get from the grocery store. Absolutely. Peace. Finally made it to Safeway. It took a little bit to get here because we wanted to stop by Starbucks. Uh, so we grabbed quick little coffees and some water because we needed that. And just yeah. to be very clear, it's an Americano and I asked for a splash of half and half. <laughs> it has no sugar. So I'm already starting this journey. But they gave you a splash. No, I know. My they point is, no, no, no. Because you oh. know how we're trying to get down in the LBs. So I just wanted to say this does have no sugar in it. And it really, I just asked for a pinch of half and half. So we're gonna make a quick grocery list and we'll see you guys in just a minute inside of Safeway. From our grocery haul this is actually the next day we went to Safeway to get all these items and it was just absolutely crowded and we were really really tired so hence why I'm wearing a different shirt uh, but we went today and this is all the groceries we got so we have a mixture of foods that we are going to be eating off camera um, you know before and after mukbangs and then we have uh, some mukbang foods in here too so I'll show you which is which and what's the difference okay so we're gonna start off with one of my favorite snacks and I think one of Jamil's favorite snacks as well um, the Clausen dill pickles they come cold they're already refrigerated they're whole pickles and they are delicious this is our favorite pickle brand for sure okay super low calorie um delicious tasty lots of flavor in it okay so we love that what else did we get we got um some corn this is going to be for another mukbang that we're doing so just a can of corn nothing too amazing uh you guys vegetable oil we finally got vegetable oil for those of you who know we were baking um some cupcakes recently and we're baking some other cake. And anyways, we only had olive oil, but and now we- brownies. And brownies, yep. Now we have vegetable oil as well. So, super stoked about that, okay? And then, so, uh, one of the mukbangs that we're doing is we're gonna be doing store brand versus brand brand? Yeah, generic versus- Generic versus- Real brand. Real? Okay, I don't know what that is. <laughs> um, so anyway, so this is one of the things we're gonna be comparing is a lemon lime signature select, which is from Safeway, versus a Sprite. Okay, so like the same flavor, but we'll be comparing those. Um, same with these, we have Cheez-Its for a mukbang, 
And then we have a signature select cheese bite. So we're going to be comparing these two as well. Okay. We have some limes. We have some lemons. Um, those are going to be for mukbangs as well. But also we like to put it into water sometimes. Get a little flavor going. Also we're doing a seafood boil this week. So we'll have the lemons for that. So that'll be really good. Okay. And then I got some... Um, one third less fat cream cheese. This is for myself. Um, you guys, let me show you. This is my zero net carb bagels, you guys. They're thin, slim foods, zero net carb, everything bagels. So this is a really good snack. So again, there's no net carbs in this. They come frozen. Um, but what I love to do sometimes if I'm like really hungry and actually like want a kind of a meal, like a hearty meal off camera, I will do the zero bread, carb bread bagels i should say do a little bit of cream cheese and i bought some tomatoes and some red onion and i also have cucumbers so it's like a little uh, bagel sandwich so i'm super excited about this so get yourself some of this we got some signature select waters just some flavored waters again you know oftentimes jameel especially jameel he loves his soda as well those, yeah i was gonna say those are sodas right flavored sodas this flavored water but it's oh, like soda it's soda it tastes like soda so we got some signature select uh, flavored water, but it is like soda. A kiwi strawberry flavor, a mango pineapple. These look really good. So it's a nice thing to have during mukbangs after. And again, there's zero calorie. Super, super delicious. We got some f generic frosted flakes. It's going to be for the mukbang. And we have some real frosted flakes for the mukbang. So we'll be comparing these two, see what's better. Um, we got some generic... Eggos and some real Eggos, as you can see. So we'll be doing that for a mukbang as well. Um, we have some cucumbers. So not only are we doing this for a seafood boil, I love to have cucumbers as a snack. They're crunchy, they're refreshing, they're delicious. We already have some hummus from Costco that I got. Um, so sometimes I dip it in hummus, but oftentimes I will eat this just by itself and it's really, really good. I like some... Dijon mustard, if I make a little sandwich on my low carb bread, um, this Dijon mustard is really good. Also, this is like a keto um, strawberry jam. Um, so it's uh, very low in sugar, very low in carbs. So if we want to put this on a piece of low carb bread or maybe even the bagels with a little bit of peanut butter, um, this is a really great um, strawberry jam to get. Uh, we have some black beans. This is for a mukbang. Nothing special. Um, and then we're going to be comparing, sorry, our store brand Oreos versus the real brand Oreos. So these both look great. We're going to see if they taste different. If they taste the same. We'll see. But that's for a mukbang. Okay. So this is for our personal life. Like I said, some tomatoes and red onion. Nothing special. It's always good to have some Daisy Light sour cream handy. As you know, we love tacos, we love burritos, we love, you know, we eat them all a lot for mukbangs as well. So having some light sour cream is really nice to have handy. If I wanna make a little sandwich off camera, again, with my low carb bread, with my mustard, this is ultra thin Swiss cheese. So this only has 40 calories per slice, very low in calories, only three grams of fat, very low in fat. Just do one piece of cheese so you get your cheese fix. But as you know, cheese can be really fattening and high calories. This is a great alternative because you get your cheese, but they're very thin slices. I was mentioning our low carb bread. This is what I'm talking about. This is our low carb bread we get. This is called Sola. It's Sola brand, only 60 calories a slice. And it only has basically three net carbs per slice. Three net carbs per slice. Very tasty, very delicious. I think it tastes like regular bread, so it's good. So if I want to make a sandwich, I use a little bit of light mayo, not too much. I have to have that in moderation. Oh, and then Jamil loves these. These are usually outside of mukbangs. We'll be drinking these. No, I drink them sometimes on the mukbang. Yeah. I have before, at least. So it's basically like a kombucha. It's a probiotic drink, um, but it's really, really good. There's 
um, citrus ginger flavor. There's a cherry hibiscus flavor. But this is to make you uh, not feel bloated, basically. Like afterwards, like if we eat a big meal and we're feeling bloated, we'll drink some of this. It has you belch, which is great. And then it really gets, um, you know, your body moving and your intestines going, if you know what I'm saying. But in a good way. And, it, and it's healthy. So we like to drink these kombuchas. And then we got some milk for the cereal. So we usually don't drink milk regularly, but for the um, cereal, for the mukbang we did, this is Almond Breeze Vanilla, but it has a hint of honey. You guys, this is so delicious. You have to try this almond milk. It's one of our favorites that we get, okay? Delish. And then we also got an unsweetened vanilla for our mukbang. If I am gonna drink milk off camera, which is super rare, it would be an unsweetened vanilla. Low calorie, low sugar. Okay, uh, let's see, we're wrapping it up almost. So for the mukbang, we're gonna be comparing the Kraft mac and cheese versus our Safeway um, brand mac and cheese. So this is gonna be fun. So we're gonna see which one is better. Is there a difference? Um, for us, uh, just for flavor, we like our Valentina hot sauce. We got some more Ortega taco sauce, which is super good. Um, and then for a mukbang, we're gonna be comparing Jimmy Dean um, breakfast sandwiches versus our Safeway brand breakfast sandwiches. We'll see if there's a difference. We'll see what tastes better. But that is basically it. So as you can see, there's a mixture of snacks that we're um, gonna be able to eat off camera. If I'm eating bread off camera, it is a low carb situation. Um, I like to mainly snack on, again, like veggies, like cucumbers. We have carrots already in the fridge. Um, I, we try to fast a lot, so we try not to eat too much before our off camera. That's why we didn't get a ton of off camera, like off mukbang kind of foods. Um, but we have some nice snacks if we need to. I've got some lunch meat as well, so I usually like a sliced turkey or a sliced ham. Sometimes I'll just eat that by itself. Just a little bit of protein to fill me up, tide me over, um, so we can make room for like these mukbang foods, okay? So I think that's everything, right babe? Oh. I missed this. What's this? It's, uh, did you buy these? I did. Smash gummies? <laughs> what are these? Those are. Jamil, you have to healthy. explain yourself on this. Well, those are healthy snacks for. Oh, okay. Apparently, it's it's yes, yeah, it's, it's low carb, low sugar, <laughs> no sugar. I think. Um, it says twenty two carbs. Yeah, but it's low. <laughs> okay, this is rogue. <laughs> Jamil went rogue. I throw these away. Okay, no. smash gummies, fresh pick, snack blah blah. Um, they're gluten-free, but... Well, that's why I got them. No. Because there's no gluten. Yeah, I didn't even see these. You see? When you bring your husband to the grocery store with you, this is what happens. This is Rogue. You know Jamil. He needs his sweets. It is what it is. Okay. Other than that, that's all of um, the items we got in our grocery haul. We hope that, um, you know, we kind of um, showed you some new items that you maybe haven't gotten before. Maybe you want to try it because these are really, really good um, and delicious and... Um, so we hope you enjoyed our uh, grocery haul. Woo -woo. <clears throat> okay, fam, we have come to the end of our vlog and we really hope you enjoy the video for today. Once again, this is gonna be the first of many vlogs that we're gonna do. So we hope you really enjoyed it. Um, we want you to take a look right below this video right now. There should be a little subscribe button right now. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, go ahead and click the bell as well to get notified every time we put out a video. Because um, once again, we will be doing a lot more of these. So until next time, guys, we hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Peace. So we want to show you that and get you guys a little bit familiar with what the, with what, who. What is up, fam? Today is our very first vlog. Ah! Okay, you guys, so Jamil's gonna try to high five me as one of the challenges. So let's see if you can high, high five me. I'm gonna hold my hand out and we're gonna see if you can. Ow! <laughs> God! I... So we're gonna go inside. We're gonna, well, okay, actually, let me start because I'm gonna cut that part. Before we go inside, we're just gonna make a quick grocery list uh, and then we're gonna go in there. Uh, no, that's not what I just wanna say. Here's what I'm gonna say. There's something on your lip. Oh, thank you. On your top lip. Mm, I do, yeah. thank you. Here we go. <clears throat> Let me get out of the sun. Your hair looks dyed. We had to do that three times, that yes. take. <laughs> we just did that take three times. Because they couldn't. It needed to be the perfect ending. 
Before we go, I had to show you something that's actually pretty funny. Now, I, I talk about this too on the channel. <laughs> My underwear, guys, is so bad. From walking and little doing little things. Look at this. This, you guys, is what I'm dealing with. I had to buy more. I had to buy more. It looks like... It looks like I've been shot at in underwear. <laughs> <laughs> look, look at that. So bad. Look at that. Yeah. I, and I keep washing these. I, I just took these out of the dryer. I'm like, why do I oh keep? Oh my god, you need to throw them away. They're going right in the trash. I feel like you. Well, I bought more. We actually just bought more last week when we did our Walmart video. So we're good to go. He's so, wearing whole free yes. underwear. Yes. Right pretty now. much. It's great for AC. You get plenty of air in there, so it's pretty nice. <laughs> it's a good breeze. 